Hey, Nick here with this weekly IndieMon. I'm playing the game Line, available for Windows, Mac, and Linux on Steam for $2.99. Also, for the same price, it's on iPhone and iPad. Then, finally, it's available for $2.50 on Android. For this video, I played it for Windows on Steam. It's another puzzle game on this week's IndieMon. I've been in a mood for puzzles and searched Steam for a nice game to feed myself. That's when I came across Line, a simple-to-understand puzzle game where you must connect all the colored shapes together. For example, all the red squares must be connected by the start and end blocks. In the end, all the blocks should be highlighted, and you'll be on your way to the next puzzle. You'll start getting multi-blocks, where you must touch it the amount of times the block is labeled. What makes this tricky is once a line is put down, you can't touch it or go through it. This gets difficult later on when I kept finding myself blocking other shapes in, and having to clear the board after thinking I had it, only to be wrong. That's pretty much it for gameplay, but there are a ton of levels to play. I'm currently halfway through the main game's packs of puzzles. What is amazing is after you complete some packs, you unlock daily puzzles. These are new levels given to you every day. When I first saw I unlocked this, I thought it was going to be a couple of puzzles to play each day. I was wrong. These are packs of levels, and each pack has 25 puzzles to them. I think that's amazing. You also can unlock new palette colors as you carry on through the main game. According to Steam, I've played 4 hours so far, and I'm only halfway through the puzzles. So there's a lot of game here for the price tag of $2.99. Before I wrap this video up, I just want to mention a side effect I've been getting from this game. I'm not sure if it has a name, but I've read about it before. Usually most people get it from Tetris, but I'm getting it from Line. When I'm not playing, I start seeing puzzles in my head, and I try to figure them out. I was watching a movie earlier, and these puzzles kept coming up in my mind. It was a little distracting, you could say. So this game gets a recommendation from me. It's exactly what you want in a puzzle game. Just something to focus on and keep peace within your mind. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more content. Also, make sure to come back next week for another IndieMon.